Hey everyone, Spirosha here and today I'm gonna do the three marker challenge. Um, I chose uh, three markers of course and the colors I chose were powder pink because I, yes, I really wanted to use a skin tone because I wanted to look the drawing, but the drawing looked more realistic. And the second color I chose was lilac. It was a new color I had bought um, a few weeks ago and I haven't used it much. So I wanted to try that one out. And the third color is called deep reddish blue. I can't find the red in it. It's just uh, some sort of violet blue. And I thought it would look really pretty with the pink and I would be great to combine those two together so uh, well for this challenge of course it is all about blending because you only have three markers to use and normally I will use um, three to four for only the skin tone so it's quite a challenge and actually I didn't try the colors out before starting this drawing so I really wanted to explore it the way while doing this drawing and I wasn't sure how the deep reddish blue would um, would look on the skin tone and it turned out not what I wanted to but I I found out that the pink one the lighter color worked very very well on the skin tone and exactly what I wanted so it was great and the blue color of course really fits with the pink so that was was a great thing and while I was drawing I I thought hmm maybe I drew too much detail and too many different things to color with only three colors it's kind of it, it's kind of risky but I think it really worked out and while drawing this I was thinking doing another one with three opposite colors from this one because I really love this color scheme and it is something I would use normally of two so for the next one I would like to use more green and yellow and a bit more on that type those type colors so something really different but it would be a challenge for the skin tone because I'm not sure if I'm gonna use a skin tone or just that I make her blue or green or or yellow you know just to make it more weird yes I want to make a weird drawing <laughs> something not not normal or common so yeah this challenge was also really nice to try out those new copics I had the lilac one and the deep reddish blue I still don't know why it's called reddish blue. Reddish. There is nothing red in this in this copic. And even the the number and the letters are BV for blue violet. So there's there's not even an R in this code name. Well, anyway, someone came up with the name. So yeah. And to finish this Drawing up, I just used a Sakura Jelly White roll just to give it a highlight thing and just a little more and it actually looks like a normal drawing. And I showed it to my parents and they were like, only three markers but I can see more colors. And I'm like, no, there are just three markers I used. So that was kind of a compliment. So yeah, I actually really enjoyed drawing this, it was fun. I haven't used my Copics in a while for a manga drawing. I used them for school but also not much so it was fun to draw with them again. So yeah, I'm really pleased with this drawing. It turned out pretty well and I see now in this video that my uh, nails are looking quite awesome in this video. They fit the color scheme very well. So yeah, I drew some flower petals and yeah. It's done and it was really fun I would recommend doing a three marker challenge because it's really fun and you need to experiment a little so yeah 
Well, I hope you enjoyed this video and check out my other videos and like and subscribe and all that kind of stuff. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye!